Well, I've come down here to my local park because yesterday I seen these two trees here covered in this uh, frost and I thought it'd be nice to have a single tree against a pale blue sky uh, but I forgot that it's, uh, it's getting shaded out by a tree off camera here <laughs> so I'll have to find something else to do and then wait and maybe this tree will clear first and then hopefully get some pictures of this tree I think a wide angle lens for this one I think just to get uh, minimize the landscape and maximize the sky and to isolate the tree from the two trees either side right what I've done here is I've put the camera there I'm shooting at 17 mil so I'm getting low down to get as much sky as I can just to simplify the image off uh, I've shot it in landscape but I'll probably have to crop it down to uh, square and uh, that's about it just uh, put me landscape settings on so ISO 100 f11 and whatever the shutter speed is and it does a bracket at uh, two stops over two stops under then I'll alter the, the compensation so it'll be uh, one stop over one stop under and uh, here's a picture see what you think I've come a bit further back and I'm shooting it vertical and I'm shooting this at about uh, about 30 millimeter because I've gone vertical I've, uh, what I call it I can get a bit further back and the cone can narrow so I can cut out the two side trees a bit more easier um, so that's what I've done so <laughs> anyhow, my knees are freezing sitting on this on this cold ground. So that's about it here. What do you think? Did the same as did before. I just bracketed. I can barely because this hasn't got a flip up, flip down screen, whatever that's it. I can barely see where I'm shooting. You see, and uh, possibly the horizon not vertical because because uh, you're looking down like that on the side and even on the. Uh, the live view on the back, I still can't quite uh, perceive what is horizontal and what isn't. The tree is no good because it's, it's leaning an angle and it's got a kink in it. So I'm trying to go off the horizon but it's not, it's just, uh, I think that's even sloping I think because the trees are sloping down a hill. So as long as it looks okay, it doesn't really matter. As long as it looks believably straight, uh, I'll leave it at that. So, aye, so what do you think of this?
Well, I've decided to milk this composition, so I've come from over there. I've come round here. I'm taking for this angle here. And I've taken one to increase the gap between these, the background trees and this, uh, so I can crop these out. And I've also taken one to include these three trees in the composition so it's sort of like off by about here <laughs> off by about there with this row of trees behind <laughs> I don't know whether it's good or not I'm just shooting shooting stuff wildly because I've got an urgent need for some facilities and <laughs> And put it this way, there's none in the park. <laughs> so I'll have to head back home and uh, cut this uh, little video short <laughs> before, before I'm caught short. <laughs>